Hey hello this is Pavan welcome to technofilesub.com today i would like to talk about grease monkey and user scripts if you haven't heard about grease monkey it's a popular mozilla firefox extension let me just open the wiki page of grease monkey as per wiki grease monkey is a mozilla firefox extension that allows users to install scripts that make on the fly changes to web page content after or before the page is loaded in the browser so what essentially this says is that you can write a script that can modify the content of the page before or after the page is being loaded so if you go into technical details grease monkey user scripts are written in javascript and manipulate the contents of web page using document object model interface document object model interface is an api written for well formed uh, html or xml uh, it defines the logical structure of document and defines the way how the document should be accessed or modified so you need not know the entire details what this will do is that it will use this particular interface to modify the content of the web page so if you haven't installed grease monkey just go to addons.mozilla.org and search for grease monkey addon and install it once you install it you will see a little monkey icon over here Uh, using which you can write or manage the scripts that you have written and there is a popular website called userscripts.org uh where people from different parts of the world will update their scripts in this particular website and you can find the useful scripts for you so let's get back to user scripts so let's begin with uh, one simple script and see how this works uh as you already read from wiki uh user scripts are written in javascript if you don't know javascript then probably you might need to know a little bit about javascript before writing any script so uh what i'll do is i'll uh, open i'll create a new user script and name it as what do we do uh let us write a simple script for reloading uh, any page after every 5 seconds this is a simple script and how do we do it okay we'll reload google for every 5 seconds google reload let me name it name the script as google reload namespace you can give it any namespace as long as it's unique and uh, description reloads google for every 5 seconds okay and uh, includes uh, this section is that uh, you know this uh, this defines when the script should be executed uh, whatever domain names that you enter in the includes uh, that's at that location the script will be executed and excludes you can provide the urls again so let me give a regular expression so that it executes whenever a page of such is encountered so https as google is now using the secured protocol uh triple w dot google dot co dot in slash start okay i don't know if triple w is there or not we'll modify later if that is missing so it will open you the editor where you can write the script so here comes the javascript into the picture if you don't know the javascript then you cannot write a script uh for reloading a page for every 5 seconds um uh, for reloading you can use the function called location dot reload which will reload the page but for every 5 seconds uh then we need to set time out i mean let me write the script then explain it window dot set time out and uh, in set time out i'll uh, it will take two parameters one is what should be timed out so i am writing a function where inside that function i'll use location dot reload so this function will reload for every 
5000 milliseconds that is nothing but 5 seconds so this will set time out i mean it will wait for 5 five, 5 seconds and it will reload the page and whenever the page is being reloaded the script will be executed again and again it will wait for 5 seconds and then it will reload again so this is a continuous loop where it keeps on reloading so let's test it if it's working fine or not i i just save the script and i'll open the url that is mentioned over here i mean so the page is loaded now and let us see if it's working fine or not see the page reloaded we'll wait for another 5 seconds again the page is reloaded we'll wait for another 5 seconds again and the page is again reloaded so this works fine and this is how we write these scripts in uh, grease monkey add on and there are many popular scripts in user scripts.org and probably you might want to go through any particular script and understand how that works and develop a new user script so that it meets your needs um, on a page i mean we have spoken about the youtube center add on i mean a user script which will help you to you know restructure the content in uh, uh, the youtube website and i have written one user script which will help me to automatically log in into my network if it finds that it i have been logged out so you can achieve many functions i mean the road is open for you you can find number of applications by this particular user script hope you find this useful thanks for watching have a nice day bye bye